Oyster Splashdown next. Cape Cast. Howdy, folks. I'm Eric Williams, and welcome to Cape Cast, the official webcast of the Cape Cod Times for May 7th. See him seed the oyster beds of Osterville in the second half of the show. But first, let's take a look at news. In the Gargle Battle Department, Yarmouth voters soundly rejected a plan to fluoridate the town's water supply at town meeting last night. Currently, no Cape Town fluoridates its water supply. In the It Could Have Been Worse Department, two people were taken to Cape Cod Hospital with minor injuries after a car careened through a fence, down a seawall, and onto C Street Beach in Dennisport last night. The incident remains under investigation. Hey folks, Cape Cast rode along on a bivalve delivery yesterday in Osterville. Local shell fishermen donated 20,000 oysters to the town for reseeding on the recreational beds. Cape Cod Oyster Company and uh, Barnstable Sea Farms are giving oysters to the town of Barnstable for the recreational shell fishermen. And we're doing that because they do it in, on, the, on the Barnstable side, the north side of Barnstable. They've been doing it, Tom Marcotti and the town has been doing it for several years. It's been very successful. We thought it would be nice to sort of start it on the south side of the Cape to give the people that never go to the north side of the Cape a, a chance to get some oysters for Thanksgiving and Christmas. And what's going on behind us right here? Well, they're grating the oysters. So they're grating it through a one-inch mesh, and the, and the stuff that's uh, falling through the mesh is either dead or too small to plant. Uh, it's just runts, which is what we call them, basically. We can put some at the wreck area. Wait, right here, what do you think? Yeah, definitely. Put some there, huh? Definitely. Look at this heroic team behind me, scraping, throwing the one-year-old babies right down into the drink. Unbelievable bivalve drama. Right here. And Barnstable. We're on the boat. We got a bunch of oysters there. Is it a science uh, as we distribute them? What's going on? Yeah, I call it the free plant pepper as you go. Yeah. <laughs> pepper as you go method. And try to get a widespread. It's a lot of hope. You, know, you, you throw them, you plant them, and Mother Nature is the final determinant what, what you get in the fall. Just like a fine wine, uh, a great oyster is, uh, it all depends on its location. And in these, these bays on the south side and the north side of the Cape and all over the Cape, the sandy bottom makes for a, a really fine quality oyster. Okay, let's shuck open the world of sports. In the show me the love department, Harwich blanked Mashpee and Boys High School tennis five to nothing yesterday. Now let's check the all-important Cape and Islands weather forecast, backed by Wellfleet Woodpecker video. For tonight, a slight chance of showers after 2 a.m., increasing clouds with a low around 54. For Thursday, a chance of showers with thunderstorms also possible after 1 p.m., mostly cloudy with a high near 55. Okay, we've got to get out of here. This has been CapeCast for May 7th. Till next time, see ya! Cape Cast.